Well, hello Capricorn. Thank you guys so much for coming to the reading. I love you guys so much. I love Capricorns a lot. I am Capricorn rising. You guys are amazing, powerful people. Just the best, really. I love you guys so much. This reading tonight is going to be about the full moon, the energy around the full moon. It's going to last for three months from the night that it's done. The full moon is high in the sky above my head. So I'm completing the working really hard to finish all of the readings tonight. Um, there is also an energy of abundance, Capricorn. There's abundance that's coming to you. Maybe from an, a source that you don't expect. You've got the Midas touch at the moment for some reason. This full moon in Virgo is a very good time for you for business, for expansion for some reason. There's really strong spiritual power behind you. Many of you have been manifesting and doing the mundane work that requires that manifestation. The prayers, the herbs, the recitations, the incantations, the affirmations. You guys are very powerful. When you do something like that, it does manifest and it comes quickly. The deck that I'm going to be using tonight is the Lenorm Fairy Lenormand deck. It's the deck of the fairies. So beautiful Lenormand um, edition. And I actually adore fairies and I have a strong connection with them. If you look at my videos, I've just uploaded um, a, a video of an actual fairy. I know many people might not believe this, but this is real. Go and check it out. It's on the list of the videos. Also, please have a look at the 2022 prophecy readings because a lot of prophecies that have been made on this channel are coming to pass now. Um, on that video, I did say I saw something in London and I saw like a big ball of mud coming. Then something was going to happen in London after that. Now, yesterday or the day before in London, there was a sandstorm and they don't come in London. Okay, people were very scared. The sky was orange and it was very dark. Apparently some spillover from Africa that came over the sea and so on. It, it dusted a lot of Europe, <laughs> but it was beautiful and gorgeous. But it was like, you know, my premonition started to come true. Mine usually do come true. And I have the true gift of the side, not just, you know, uh, card readings and stuff like that. People can do them. They're great. Um, and everyone has the way of delivering a message. It's not like I'm better than anyone. But I can see things before they happen. I get actual visions. So I'm being dr uh, like driven to tell you guys about these two videos. You need to see them. The fairy one will really make you feel that there's still magic in this world. So let's see what the fairies have for you tonight. The first message that they want to give you guys. I'm just shuffling the cards. They are talking about this abundance and about the, the time of the full moon is, she's saying it's very good for manifestation. Wow, look at the star. You got the star card. So it's either you're in the entertainment business, Capricorn, or someone you know is in the entertainment business. They have their eye on you. They could be a Capricorn as well. The, the star card as well is about creativity and creation of new things. So if I know Capricorns are extremely creative, like they're the best cooks ever in the world. I've never seen someone who can cook better than a Capricorn, honestly. You know, they just have to learn the basics and then after that it becomes like, like luxury cuisine. <laughs> so you guys are amazing. You're perfectionists. You make everything like really, ha really happen, you know. And you've got a big chance at manifesting something huge here and it's going to come to pass. This star card could also be someone with Aquarius or an Aquarius in the chart that's going to be influential in your life. They could be your friend, they could be your partner. I'm Aquarius Sun, so maybe this reading is significant for some of you. You just have to pay attention because it's like, you know, I'm being flooded with um, things. You have really good news coming towards you. This fairy here, this gorgeous fairy here on the boat, this is the ship. This could talk about things that are overseas or someone that is overseas. This could be a love situation, but I'm getting a strong energy of business and love combined. Or like a love situation that's very abundant. There's going to be fast movement soon. The ship is a card of moving ahead. The divine is lighting the way forward for you with this lantern. You are full of goodness 
full of energy, full of creativity. You're ready to soar. You're ready to soar. This is high prime time for you. I'm also getting the spirit saying to me, use the lemongrass herb. Use the lemongrass herb if you can. Or just use some lemongrass essential oil. Lemongrass changes all negative energy to positive energy. It balances the energies and it clears obstacles. It attracts love and money, especially same-sex love. Lemongrass. Especially if it's men. Or like a divine masculine is doing it for a feminine. It, that, it does attract love from everywhere, but I've noticed that it's very strong when I work with it for same-sex relationships. Now, there is a new beginning coming towards you with this coffin, okay? And it's fast approaching. The coffin is a card of new beginnings, initiation. Some kind of lift-off is going to happen in your life, Capricorn. It's an initiation of sorts. You're going to get communication. This is the letter card, which is a written communication confirming what I'm telling you in this reading. Congratulations as well. The number 27 is a number of congratulations. Eight is a number of completion. Here, 27, eight is completion and infinite abundance, something going on forever. I'm also getting the letter H in your name or in someone else's name. It could be anywhere in the first or second names. If you have a project you're working on, you wanna publish or you wanna start Capricorn, go for it. If you started something, it's gonna to soar to the sky. I just heard someone literally say, yeah. <laughs> One of the spirits, yeah. You know, with such passion. So yeah, this is definitely gonna happen, okay? So if you said yes when you were seeing this, then my, my dear, you are looking at huge changes and huge success, okay? You've been waiting and working and waiting patiently, but the beauty that is in you and the power that is in you is unmatched anywhere. They won't find anyone like you, Capricorn, honestly. This is coming to you very quickly, within 12 days, 12 hours, so something like that. 12 minutes from when you finish the reading, or on the 12th of a month or something like that, but it, it it's never ever goes beyond um, 12, I would say, three months from the time that the reading is done, like these things, they manifest. Readings are timeless, but this is definitely coming towards you now, 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 now is the time for it. It's not going to be delayed. It is success. There is a strong loving energy here, a psychic energy. Thank you so much. Very generous and abundant. Thank you so much. I promise I will make a, a, a link for donations. I know someone wants to donate. I can feel it. Thank you so much. You're so generous. May God the most high reward you in millions of multiples for what you're doing. If you are donating to help me like get the stuff that I need and stuff. I'm reading on a really small desk and uh, you know, I don't have many decks, but I'm okay, I'm okay. I mean, I don't need anyone to really donate, but I will start it as soon as the spirits say, okay, because in the past they told me not to put a donation link on. Maybe there was something going on with scammers or something, but I do feel these scammers are gonna get start getting caught now. Something is gonna happen very, very bad for these scammers. It's about time. They're fools attacking psychics channel and spiritualist channels. We can find you, the nerve, <laughs> the nerve they had. <laughs> you can, you know, this is universe is one unit. They can't hide. It's so funny how online people think that they're safe behind their screens. Um, but not from someone who's truly gifted, but they will use their gifts wisely. They won't hurt you unless you decide to do something first and I do feel that this is for directed for a scammer who could be watching this now your end is near <laughs> okay so we are thinking about what to do the Sun is coming out onto your life Capricorn no more juggling the money no more having to be strong because you don't have this or have that or can't do this or can't do that it's being opened up to you and i feel this is some, the eight is also talks about karmic repayment you've done so many good things for so many people you're just so blessed capricorn incredible people you're incredible people i mean honestly 
and the power I see with Capricorns, I don't see with any other sign I'm saying the truth and may God be my witness. Now, heartbreak is going to be over, okay? You are definitely coming up victorious here. And the spirits are just telling you, just rest assured that you're definitely going to have a huge victory very soon, okay? Whatever you're worried about is going to go away. Superstardom, they're saying. So big. So powerful. Um, it's almost like miraculous or divine intervention. An initiation. Or something, someone's going to initiate something towards you. Now let's do the questions. They said do the questions, yes or no questions. So um, uh, please ask me yes or no questions. Three questions. Ask the first question and I will use this beautiful other deck, the Nefertari deck, which I love very much, this one, uh, to answer the question. So let's go for the first question. I'm just shuffling, waiting for them to say, but you are flying high. <laughs> Goodness me. Oh my God. You got the Hierophant Capricorn, come on man. This is not even funny. The, the Hierophant is like the one, or the one thing that you've been wanting to do, one thing that you've wanted to be successful. Whether it is money or love, it is coming towards you. The Hierophant is also about modesty. So you are very modest, you know, um, Capricorns are like that. You're very patient. The Hierophant is patience. You're being congratulated for being patient, having pity on others, clemency. You're being relieved from all pain. You are the ultimate, you know, like spiritual guide, Capricorn. If you are a reader or someone who has the, the, the gift or is in strong intuition, you're the ultimate spiritual guide, the wise man, the wise woman that people go to, like a priest or a doctor, or you could be dealing with a priest or a doctor or a lawyer, the Hierophant. Um, the guy sitting on the, th on the throne here is Osiris. And he is the one who stands at the head <clears throat> of the Egyptian pantheon. He's the one who uh, brought religion to humanity. The religion of the one God. So they call it the sun disk, but it's about the one God. The sun disk used to represent you know, the continuity, continuity of the one energy, as I understand it from my ancestors. Um, now, <clears throat> you are, if you are, have been looking for love, this is a card that says this person is going to be the one. It could be the person who's giving you a hand, helping you, you know, reach your fame <clears throat> and fortune. Modesty is also important. I just want to remind everyone that even though we could get a lot of success and money and beauty and so on, remember where you came from. Take the people who are help, have been helping you on your journey with you. Don't leave anyone behind. When you are given, you are supposed to give. This is why we are given, to give. We are not given to take, just to take for ourselves. We are given to give and I know that Capricorns understand that very well. And you do give back. So I'm saying congratulations. This is a huge yes. If there was any yes, this is it. Let's see about the second question. Wow, man. It's crazy. Powerful energy. But you guys are so generous. I'm still feeling that person that wants to donate. Let me see if I can put this link up tonight. <laughs> Maybe this needs to happen. So the second question is temperance. Temperance is like about keeping a level head, okay? Don't go crazy because it is going to go crazy around you. Okay, so <laughs> be calm, collect it, take it as it comes, make your needs clear. If you need to sleep all day like I do and you just work in the afternoon and the evening because, you know, you work at night better and stuff like that, say that to them. 
if you need time to rest, to eat, to cook, to clean, to do anything, say that to them. People need to respect you and your boundaries. It's up to you. You are the star here. Okay? Now, the card of temperance is about harmony as well. And like having the spirit of adaptability. So you, you just have to be in anticipation of it, but not worry about it because it's going to be, a, the spirit is saying it's going to be a happy transformation. It's about holidays as well and rest and like, you know, healthy entertainment, not something that will damage anything or yourself or others. You're giving out a very beautiful message of light, of love and light. Um, you're very magnetic as well, Capricorn. And it's about like almost this thing that happens it's going to allow you to recover from all the hurt that you've been through. Goodness me, someone here has been through it. Oh my God. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I'm feeling the energy of someone who's been really through it for years. They've been so patient though. And this is why it's going to be incredible. If you go to my reading for the collective, the prophecy for 2022, I'm saying it there because the Spirit told me to say it. This year is going to be a year where God will come for the wicked. He also, it will be a, a year of karmic repayments. People who have done good deeds will be repaid in, in kind. Because of your kindness, Capricorn, anyone who's attended this reading, because of the good that you've done, you're going to be elevated above everyone that you know. Just be prepared for it. I will leave it here so I don't jinx it. But I love you all. The answer is yes as well for the third question. If you are guessing. <laughs> Guys, if you if you have a moment to like, share and subscribe. Or, or um, you know, to comment. I'd be very grateful. It motivates me. It gives me my strength. Um, it means a lot to me. I don't feel discouraged when I get at least one like. Even one like or one comment will make my day. You know. So please be kind and generous as you are and you know i know you are and if you have a moment just do it you know don't push yourself if you don't have time it's fine if you have a moment you can you know do it and may god the most high protect you bless you and make all of your wildest dreams come true and may you capricorn rise amen thank you